The Pats, they've had internal discussions about Jul- Julio Jones. Bring him on. Yeah, Nick, so I want to hear your opinion on this. So do you, would you want Julio Jones? I would take him for not for the money that, that he's got on his contract. What does he have on his contract right now? It was like... It's like three years, sixty-six million dollars yeah, left. Or a lot shit of money. Like All right, Mike, what do you think? Three years, sixty-six Jones, million. What up, Julio Jones to the Pats? Are you in? Uh, is, there, is that like going to happen? Is Internal that possible? Discussions. It's a, they're they're one of the teams that could get him. Uh, it's just one of those things where like they're throwing random teams no, out there. No, I mean, I, they some, make sense. There's it's some the, smoke. It's fit. With, there's some smoke there. Yeah, it's a fit. They have fifteen million dollars left in salary cap this year. And they, Julio Jones' cap hit is $15 million. They could make it work, yeah. It is nuts. a fit. <laughs> my, my only concern, my only concern is not with Julio, but with the guy throwing him the football. Cam Newton can't be Cam, the Patriots Cam, quarterback this year. Julio if they Jones, want to win, he can he Julio can't Jones can be any type of receiver you need him to be on the field, but he's also a long ball threat. I, can Cam Newton throw 50 yards to him? No, he can't even throw five he yards. Yeah, I don't think he, he can. Sucks. That's the only reason yeah. I'd be hesitant of trading for him, giving up stuff for him. If it could work, all for it. But I just don't know if I trust Cam Newton enough. And I don't know if Mac Jones is, you know, obviously ready to have yeah. a receiver like Julio Jones. So I, I don't know. I'm make, on the it, would make, it would make Mac Jones' life a lot yeah. easier. It would. No, yeah, yeah. If we're, if we're going to start leaning towards Mac Jones, sure, I'm all for it. I just don't know if it would work with him and Cam. The best way to help a young quarterback is to have a shit ton of weapons. Yeah. Sure. And an all and sure. An line. If we're going all we in on Mac Jones, I'm all in on Julio. I'm fine with that. I just don't. If we're gonna roll with Cam, yeah. I'm on the fence. Could you I'm see? Fence. Could you see like Cam having like two bad games and then Mac Jones comes? It would no. take more. No, yeah. I would say I if he think had that. four really bad games, they probably. Take I him think out. it would take until at least halfway through the season for Mac Jones to start, unless Cam Newton got injured. If Cam Newton doesn't get injured the first eight games, well, I can tell you right now, the one game that Mac Jones will not play in is Tampa. Is the Tampa game. Yeah, yeah, that will no, not. That happen. Way, the that lights will, will be way happen. too bright yeah. for him. I was there. saying, way I was saying, bright. we should go to Foxborough, do a Lumberland like video party, tailgate the thing, tailgate like. the game, get a grill. Grill up some bar, like have a barbecue. Out of- <laughs> you don't, you don't have to tell me twice. I think, I'll I think that'd be I'll fucking I'll meet you there. Yeah. Fucking, let's hit the top. Let's hit the Tampa Bay bus where it gets to the stadium. <laughs> bring the bat. Move bring the that baseball bus. bus. Tap that bus. Bring the, uh, bring the car, uh, the um, carton of eggs and stuff like yeah. that. The tomatoes. We should 100 percent do that. Casey's arm skills with the eggs. <laughs> <laughs> you got him. <laughs> I'm in. No, That'd be hilarious. hilarious. He wouldn't throw at Tampa Bay bus, though. Yeah. He'd throw roses at the bus. Mm. Tom, Tom, what's me? <laughs> not yet. Yeah, not Caesar. 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 <laughs> Caesar. Hilarious. Yeah, what other team? So when yeah. is, is when's Julio's contract up? Three, three years. years. Three, three years. years. They're so. probably gonna trade him. They're, they're, they're trading. They're looking they're to move him. Probably yeah, gonna Atlanta can't pay him. Is that what's they, going on? They, they're, they're in a, a tight weird, situation. They don't know they're what tight. they're doing. They're in a weird situation right now. They are so tight with him. I don't think they signed Kyle Pitts yet. I don't uh, think they, they do. Don't. They, they don't also have any money. I don't have money to sign him. They right also now. don't. I mean, yeah, Julio Jones is great, but for the money that they owe him, they with Calvin Ridley and Kyle Pitts, yeah. you can still be competitive. I mean, the highest competitive the Falcons well, are going to be. Well, I feel like Calvin the past Ridley. few years, Julio Jones just hasn't been like he hasn't been He's used been properly. That and like I don't know. I feel like him and Matt like he hasn't get uh, he. Matt Ryan does not look for him in the end zone mm. at all. Like his touchdown, he gets like three touchdowns a year if yeah. he's lucky. Cool, you? Yeah, he only had like three last year or two years ago. Yeah. I'll look it up. I could be wrong. Yeah, I know it's low. I know it's a low number. There was it was either last year or two years ago where he didn't get his first touchdown that, until like week six yeah, or something crazy yeah. like so that. So last year he had three touchdowns. The year before that he had there six. There we go. Well, you're Julio fucking Jones. You should be getting like 14, 15 touchdowns. You should be getting close to the ball in the red zone. Yeah. He's only had 60 yeah, career Julio, touchdowns. You only, you're Julio Jones on your team. Why especially are you throwing him every like, time? That's especially shocking just because like the Falcons' whole game plan for the past like 10 years is just like high volume. Like, yeah. You know. Yeah. Well, they've also have had a lot of weapons. And, and yeah, throughout their, that's, that's yeah, true. You know, but think Julio like Jones maybe is the best that they've had. He is. You yeah. you're thinking but like they had like Tony Gonzalez back in the day. They had fucking Roddy White. Yeah, they've had. I mean, they've had yeah. weapons throughout the years. Now they've come really. Obviously, was good for the Falcons. Didn't do shit. For yeah, the but he wasn't we gave up a fucking second round uh, pick for him. I'm so proud of you. stupid. I want to see Julio go to the Cardinals. Yeah, that'd be sick. That would what? be terrifying. Yeah, I think they could do it. Hopkins, 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 Hopkins said he'd restructure Hopkins, his contract. Yeah, literally said if they that got he Julio. would take a cut for for Julio. To that. Do. Would be insane. That'd be a leap. Hopkins and Julio. Oh Hopkins, Julio, God. AJ Green, Larry Fitzgerald. You know Larry Fitzgerald's Damn. coming back. That'd be insane. You know Fitzgerald's <laughs> yeah, coming just back to, just for to another year. Oh yeah. <laughs> Kyler throwing to him. Yeah. 
That'd be they an got elite their offense. D line. I mean, they got JJ Watt, obviously. Yeah, that'd be a fun Did they team sign Clowney? No, they no, no Brown the Browns signed Clowney. I'm thinking everyone signed. Everyone signed with the Cardinals. Yeah, yeah. They, everyone I signed mean, with the Cardinals. If they got Jones, you mean some serious freaking business in Arizona? Yeah, yeah, I mean, right now I think they're on the fence of being like the winner of that division, but they have Julio. I'm thinking they're they're the clear winners. Yeah, of that Cliff division. Kingsbury doesn't know his ass from his elbow. That's true. Though. But that talent, the talent though, I mean, that's a lot Murray's of talent. Yeah. I think, yeah, I think, I think Kyle Murray, to me, Kyle Murray is like the sleeper to win Kyle MVP Murray. this year. I think so, too. I think he could have a he, sleeper he, MVP For eight year. weeks last, last year. Last year, yeah. I mean, he was up there. For First eight bit, weeks, he yeah. was like, great. Yeah. I had my fantasy team. I had Kyler. I had, as, it was a keeper league. And so I drafted, somehow Rodgers slipped to like the 10th round or something like that. Mm-hmm. I drafted Rodgers and had Kyler as my backup. Kyler, yeah, that's a great, it's pretty elite. That's a great yeah. pick. Uh, Rodgers might not even play this year, so... We'll see. I was about to say, like, is he probably just gonna stay on the Packers now? Oh, they signed like four <laughs> practice for him. They got signed Blake, Blake Bortles. Bortles. I mean, he just Blake said Bortles. that he was unhappy, whatever. Like, all they got that Blake stuff. Bortles and some other guy, and that was the last I heard of it. I don't know. I just <laughs> died down. Yeah, I mean, this it'll pick up again. With it. it'll, it'll, it'll pick up it'll again. Pick up the show, again. Show ain't playing the show. Sean's not playing. No one's gonna when, want him. When does the season first start? Start, start September. September, yeah. September. Mm-hmm. So yeah. we got three months. A little three months. It'll be. A tra- I think it'll be a training camp thing. Yeah, we'll see what happens. They say they can't trade Julio until left of June one or something. Yeah, like that. same with Rodgers. Does a cap hit or whatever? Yeah. Are the Cardinals like one of the other teams that are in talks with? There are them? a lot of teams that are interested there are a few in that. Teams. What are some other teams? Uh, Patriots, them, uh, Green Bay. Green Bay. Uh, I see. That would be kind Bills of sick maybe. Of I think I saw the, the Bills. The same team too. Yeah, yeah. that would be sick. Cowboys are team. Cowboys are interested I mean, I in everyone. Giants. Uh, never yeah, mind. honestly, I'm reading something else there. Let's I will see. say Rogers has basically never like they've had very weak receivers like while they don't draft him Who? receivers besides De- DeAndre oh, um, De- uh, Devontae the Tom, Devontae Adams the Packers, yeah they don't do it yeah they draft uh, Jordan Love instead hey we drafted to kill Harry right easy <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was a tough one uh, DK Metcalf. Yeah. Oh, remind me. Yeah, there's a few teams. I oh, one team that I did see, the Titans. Oh, that'd be, oh, that'd interesting. be interesting. That would be I like that. Him and Derek Henry? Hit yeah. And AJ Brown. Woo! It's, a, Woo! it's an elite offense. That would be an elite offense. It's one way to ease the pain of Juno Smith going to the Patriots. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so there's a few teams that would be interested yeah. in them. It's just going to come down to. He'll get moved. Uh, that price, who gets them, how yeah. much the Falcons get back from whatever team, and yeah. We'll see. We'll see. So, wait, do you guys we'll have see. any predictions for what team? Or uh, I, I'm not yeah, saying I this. I, no, I, I have a no way. Bill's not paying him. No way. I have a sneaky feeling the Patriots can be one of the top teams to get him. I don't think they will get him. It seems like they're one of the top teams. No, I know. But I think they're gonna make a run at him. Is what I'm saying. I think a team, another team, will pay more and will get him. I, I like the Titans. I like the Titans. I like the Titans. I, I think if they really. Want to like turn themselves into a legit contender? I mean, they were a legit contender. That's how you go about it. But now you're really like then you're, you're you solidify yourself in, stone. Yeah. in the top of the AFC with the Chiefs. I'm I think with Julio Jones. Colts. I'm, I'm sticking. Colts are a good move too. I think. Colts, yeah, Colts could be a sneaky team too. I'm uh, sticking with the Cardinals. The thing is with the NFL. NFL the thing with the NFL is like you have all these teams that could be interested, but there's also those teams that could come out of the woodworks and just like make a trade for him, like Chargers. Give Herbert, Give Herbert so, a yeah, weapon. Keenan Allen, Herbert. That'd be kind of gross having Keenan Allen. Yeah. yeah. I mean, that could be good. That could be one of the best receiving duos in the NFL. Yeah. I got a sleeper one for you. All right. The More than team. the Colts? More than the Colts. The Chicago Bears. Give Justin Fields Ooh. a little option. Mm-hmm. Allen Robinson. Allen Robinson. Give a little Robinson. option out there. Jones could be nasty. Especially if Mr. Rogers don't play in Green Bay. That, that's yeah. a bit of jump for grabs that's over there. true. That's yeah, not, that's that's interesting. That'd be that'd be interesting. That's what I'm saying. There's so many teams. The Bears you can still just, stink. You can think that <laughs> the Bears uh, are gonna do Bears things and be awful. Yeah. The Bears.